What's up YouTube? I am in the car and we are at the grocery store. My name is Joy Neville if you don't know. If you're new to my channel, thank you for subscribing and supporting me in my healthy journey. This is a positive channel where we promote mental health, physical health, all the good stuff that it takes to live your life. I've lost 141 pounds on my journey and I'm currently trying to lose the last 15, 20 pounds somewhere in there and just get more toned and tighten up, stuff like that. So we are doing a grocery haul today. If you want to see what I eat on my journey to maintain and to lose weight, it's lower calorie, it's lower carb, stay tuned because I'm going to show you everything I buy in the grocery store today so you can do it too, so you can live a healthy life, so you can drop a few pounds, so you can focus more on portioning all the good stuff that you need, all the good tips. So stay tuned. If you like this, subscribe, hit that like button below. And and follow me on my journey. Uh, I will see you guys back when we get in the store. Okay, you guys, so I'm gonna get some party wings. These are great in the air fryer or baking them in the oven for low calorie, high protein, low carb. My husband's getting some bread and some bagels for the boys. Say hi, babe. Hi, babe. <laughs> okay, let's keep looking. Cheese is on the list, isn't it? I'll bring them back when I get more stuff. Okay guys, so far we got strawberries, two of them. I've got the bagged garden salad. It's just mixed iceberg lettuce and cabbage. I got two of those. We've got cherry tomatoes. I've got a bag of apples. We've got classic Bolt House Farms dressing. This is my favorite. It's in the refrigerated section. It's very low calorie and it's really good. And then we got cheese. And, and I got three of these. Chunk chicken breast. So it's canned chicken, 98% fat free. These are great for chicken salad, chicken um, tacos, different stuff. So, oh, and then I got bell peppers because I'm gonna do Philly cheesesteak bell peppers. I got mushrooms, and I showed them the chicken and then your bread. Okay, and we're gonna keep. I just wanted to say this, I'm not buying it, but if you're someone that does not like water, try adding some flavors. Almost all of these are zero calorie, and some of them don't even have aspartame. Like, these trues are natural. They don't have any aspartame. Some of these are really good. So yeah, give them a try. We are looking for cranberry juice for our son and apple juice for our son. And I will bring you back when I find some other goodies. Okay guys, I'm in the bar section and they have tons of bars. I'm looking to see if there's any that I like. They have the Fit Crunch, which is really good. They have the Pure Protein. I don't see the Quest Hero. They have the Thinks. These are low calorie. So I'm gonna get, they're only $1.27. So I'm gonna get a couple of the salted caramel Think Thins because they're only 150 calories. And then I'm gonna get a couple of the birthday cake ones. They're 150 calories. And let's see, any other sweet tooth snack? They have the Special K pastries, which are low calorie. They have the fiber ones. I think I'm gonna go with, ooh, I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna try these. These look good. Mint brownie, 70 calories, fiber one. Look at these, babe. Mint brownie, that's right up my alley. Love those. So, so far guys, I have these for Sweet Tooth. I have the Think Thins. We have taco seasoning to make taco meat. We're gonna get ground chicken and lean ground beef. Um, I didn't show this. Apple cider vinegar. We got my kids' apple juice. I'm going to make a cauliflower chicken enchilada casserole with the green chili. I'm also gonna do a green bean alfredo. 
Um, I got mushrooms, salsa because that's a staple. I've got tuna and pickles because I love tuna and pickles. Soy sauce and vinegar because I'm going to make sweet and sour chicken meatballs. So, so far this is where we're at. What do you got, babe? <laughs> Cookies and cream fit crunch. You'll probably like the fit, fit crunch. They're really good. We'll see you back in a minute, guys. So ground chicken is my favorite. This brand, Isernos, is my favorite. Cindy needs some too. Will you grab her three and I'll have her pay me back for them? Because we didn't get them last time we were here. They were, they, the ones they had so were two over. So you want five and then three for Three her? for Cindy, yeah. So we're getting ground chicken, guys. Something else I got. 140 calories for one and a quarter cup. I only use a half a cup of this or less, sometimes a quarter cup for crunch on my yogurt parfait. It's just Special K red berry cereal. I only do it for crunch as a treat on my yogurt. We got cheese, sliced cheese, string cheese. What else? We're headed over to get yogurt. We got some tea, cold brew tea. There's stuff that we got coffee, there's stuff we grabbed. I'll show you guys my overall haul when we get home. What'd you get, honey? I got some little fat smokies. Boy cheddar little smokies. Some fat boy cheddar little smokies. You can eat those on keto. I know. But they're 107 calories for seven calories of them. For seven little tiny wings. It's not horrible. Okay, we're gonna go over to the dairy. <laughs> I'm getting light sour cream. This is good to mix for dips or to put in sauces to make sauce. We got cottage cheese for my son. I'm not going to eat it. I'm tired of cottage cheese, but I usually would get the fat free if I got it. And he's loading up milk for the kids. They drink Ovaltine. <laughs> I don't have little kids. They're grown, grown adult kids. <laughs> they still drink oval tea. And still <laughs> We're getting a full cart, guys. I'm gonna go right here and get whipped cream cheese because it has the lowest calories if it's whipped or spread. Let me see. Whipped right here. Whipped cream cheese because they whip air into it. It makes it seem like we're getting more for less, 50 calories. So we're gonna do the whip. My husband actually pointed that out to me, huh, babe? <laughs> okay, and then we are going to grab my fave yogurt. We already have eggs. We're gonna grab yogurt. Will you grab me one, babe? You know which one I want. Yeah. And actually, we grabbed that kind too, the cherry, because I'm starting to like that. So I got two yogurts. My son helps me eat these. And they're the Dannon Light and Fit Greek yogurts. My favorite is the strawberry cheesecake, 80 calories, 12 grams of protein. But I also enjoy the cherry, 80 calories, 12 grams of protein. Yeah, I do a quarter cup or half a cup of that and some fat-free whip and you got yourself a little parfait. All right, I think we're almost done. We need frozen blueberries, which are right over here. Canned dog food. And yeah, and then we're going to get dog food and stuff. So I'll show you guys our haul when we get back to the house. I'm going to grab a bag of frozen blueberries for my yogurt parfait. Right here. These are good if you have the frozen little fruits and berries for when you have a sweet tooth. But measure it out, always measure, because you can overdo anything. And then fat free, whip. Do you see fat free or light? Sugar free. No. Oh. Oh, right here, babe, light. Two of them? Just one. Or two, go ahead, I'll put it in the deep freezer. <laughs> For 78 cents. Yeah, that's cheap. 
All right, guys, so this is our groceries. It's full. I'll meet you at home to show you the overhaul. Bye, guys. All right, guys, we are at home. I put the groceries away that I, um, I guess, don't want to consider healthy or low calorie or low carb. So basically stuff that is for my um, sons or my husband, I put most of it away. So this is all stuff that we bought for basically me and my lifestyle. So we'll start right here. So first we have, I'm going to just recap over this. I got all the different rice cauliflowers. So this one is cauliflower medley. Okay, and you can use like stir fry rice or casseroles or whatever. I have some things coming up I want to use it for. This one's broccoli and cauliflower with cheese. It's like a cheddar one. I've never tried this one, but someone else used it and said they liked it. Cauliflower risotto medley. I've got, of course, my frozen blueberries to go in my light and fit Greek yogurts with my fat-free whip and a sprinkle of Special K cereal, and it makes a great dessert. I've got my go-to dressing. I dip chicken in it. I put it on salad. I dip veggies in it. This is my go-to. Got a few bananas, a few apples, white cheddar cakes, chocolate rice cakes, this one I put cream cheese and everything bagel seasoning. This one I put sugar-free raspberry jam and fat-free whip and Lily's chocolate chips. But you can do peanut butter, you can do whatever. Cottage cheese, I do not eat the 4% full fat. I eat the fat-free or the 1% or the 2%. Because this one just has higher calories. My son eats this, he's trying to gain weight and gain muscle. He's a very skinny, muscular boy. Um, but I thought I'd show it because cottage cheese is a good choice for a high protein, low carb, and usually low calorie if you get, you know, a lighter fat. Alfredo sauce, I use this. Oh, this is not the one. This will be for them. No, that is not the one we're using, guys. But Alfredo sauce, I do green bean Alfredo with. I will not be using that. That's 110 calories for a fourth a cup. The one I get is 40 calories for a fourth a cup. So that's not the one. I have some though in the cabinet. Uh, light sour cream. I use this a lot. Whipped cream cheese. I use these. These make great sauces in your casseroles, which I'm going to use them for. They also are good on my bagels. They're also good to make dips. Yada, yada, yada. Good on taco salads whipped. I usually get fat free but this is light. Calorie difference is nothing. They're actually the same. 20 calories for two tablespoons. It's not the best stuff you guys. You can get ready whip or real whipped cream. I just use it. I'm lazy. What can I say? You can't be perfect. I've lost 141 pounds. I'm just trying to live my best life. All right taco seasoning. These sauces I was running low on, so I have the chili garlic sauce. I'm going to make a sweet and sour chicken meatballs this week, and I use these for that sauce. Soy sauce, I use apple cider vinegar, and I don't have it right here, but sesame oil, I don't see it. I got some tiny dill pickles. I love pickles and lunch meat wraps are so good. Pickles are a great food to snack. Sugar-free jam. Salsa, always a good one to have, low calorie. My neighbor just gave me this jam, so that was sweet of them. I have kind of neighbors. <laughs> String cheese, always a go-to for me, my boys, any of us, low calorie. If you get the low moisture part skim, it's like 70 or 80. Yeah, this one's 80 for a stick. Can't beat that for a good snack. Mushrooms, I put these in a lot of stuff. I've got two things of berries. I've got bell peppers. I'm going to do Philly cheese steak stuffed bell peppers this week, hopefully. Um, cherry tomatoes, of course, avocados. Just a handful of low calorie protein bars. 150 calories, 10 grams of protein. I got salted caramel and birthday cake. 
I wanted to try these brownie mint fudge fiber ones. They have 70 calories, 5 net carbs. This one I haven't tried. I wanted to try mashed bacon cheddar cauliflower. So that sounds good. Back there, of course, I showed you guys my chunk chicken, chicken salad, chicken quesadillas, chicken tacos, chicken wraps, olives, always a must for a snack. I've got the green enchilada sauce. I'm going to be doing a chicken cauliflower enchilada casserole this week that I'll be showing you guys. Green beans for green bean alfredo. Tons of cauliflower. They were like a dollar something. So I got four frozen bags of cauliflower. I'm lazy. I buy it frozen. It's already cooked for me. Just microwave it. Party wings. I'm going to throw these in the air fryer sometime in the next few weeks and eat those. I love buying these bags of peppers and onions already cut up. It's a little pro tip to get your veggies already cut up. It makes everything better. Scrambled eggs, omelets, meats. Excuse me guys, this one wants out. <laughs> oh. Bandit has his own channel if you guys are interested in seeing my big bull massive do tricks. He's got his own channel at Bull Mastiff Bandit Dog. <laughs> that was a shout out Bandit. Okay, I've got ground chicken. I got a bunch. Some is for me and then some is for a friend. It's hard to find this brand, and when I find it, I get it. Especially when it's on sale for three bucks. Can't beat it. So ground chicken. This is Cerno's brand, you guys. Tastes so good. I showed you guys this, so I think I showed you guys everything, right? I'm pretty sure. This is the overview. Yeah, we are done, guys. Oh, there's one thing I didn't show you guys. Seaweed. This is my favorite brand of seaweed. If you don't know about seaweed, give it a try. It's, it's like a salty chip, and it's 20 calories a pack. I mean, you can't beat that. You can eat like five or six packs. And I'm someone who likes more bang for my buck. So here's my grocery haul. Let me flip you guys around. Hello. So that's it, guys. That's my grocery haul um, that me and my husband did. Thank you for watching. Thank you to all you guys that support me and say kind words and share my story. Thank you. I appreciate it. I am being so on point this next few weeks. I'm going to really work on myself. I really want to get this last little bit of weight off. I know it's not a lot to most of you, but to me, I want to finish my journey, and I want you guys to come along with me. So let's get started on your journey, or let's continue your journey. Let's get back on track. I know it's hard to get back on track or just to start up. I know it is. But go do something like this. Go pick out stuff that you can have for your groceries in your fridge, and you know meal prep it ahead and if you don't want to meal prep just have stuff you can grab it's always helpful to have stuff you can eat that's low calorie you can still eat you can still enjoy food and hot dinners and all that you just have to pick lower calorie options and that's what my grocery hauls are about showing you guys stuff that I've ate over the last almost four years in February it'll be four years that I've been on my journey most of my weight was lost in the first year 100 pounds of it was but showing you guys, I'm not, you know, gaining it all back. I'm doing something right. I just want to finish my journey. So I need to buckle down. I need to make sure I have measuring cups and tablespoons and my scale out for everything I eat for the next few months just to be a little more strict because I can maintain probably the rest of my life by eyeballing and eating intuitively. But your girl gets greedy. And so I need measuring spoons and stuff. Um, but yeah, anyways, back on subject. Grocery hauls. This is stuff I wanted to show you guys that I will be incorporating every time to let you guys know what you can choose, what you can eat, and look at. If you like something, just read the back. Read the label. If the serving is low, 40 calories, 80 calories, 100 calories, it's probably an okay thing to eat. You know, and yes, some of the stuff is packaged, or yes, you might crave something that's a little processed or might have sugar alcohol. It's better than whatever you were eating before, I promise you. And I tell myself that all the time. Joy, protein bars have sugar alcohol. You know what? Sometimes I want a protein bar. It's better than eating a candy bar. It's better than me gaining, you know, all my weight back and being 300 pounds again. 
So it's about making better choices. It's not about drastically going crazy and changing everything in your life. Read the labels and make better choices. That's what it's about. So everything you saw here today is very low calorie and a lot of it is lower carb because that's kind of just what I'm trying to lean towards. And yeah, so if you see anything that might help you out this week, let me know in the comments. We're working our way. When we get to 600 subscribers, I'm doing another drawing for two gift cards that I will mail to you guys. Probably two Visa gift cards, I'm guessing. So when you leave a comment, I write your name down. Doesn't matter what the comment is. When you leave a comment, I write your name down to put my little drawing bowl. And I draw right in front of you guys. So leave a comment, like this video, and share this video. If you share the videos, you get two drops in the in the bowl, two name draws. So yeah, that's about it, guys. We're on our way to 600 subscribers. I've got a lot coming on in the next month and to, month to month and a half, two months, um, and I just want to share it with you guys. And I got two or three new recipes coming this month of certain casseroles and the Philly cheesesteak bell peppers and tater tot casserole that's low carb yes I said it so stay tuned I love you guys thank you for watching in fact you might watch the tater tot casserole one before you watch this one I'm not sure we'll see anyways love you guys thank you for watching as always stay positive stay focused on you you are your own motivation and if you're using me for motivation thank you guys I take you guys for motivation back I use you guys back. Every comment you leave, it boosts me. It makes me want to keep going and going and going and sharing my life with you to help you. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Stay beautiful, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys.